and I'm contemplating doing a lot more like this. Prime Minister, during the course of the Victoria Falls Conference, you met Mr. Kaunda. Do you envisage any official meetings with him in the near future to discuss matters of mutual interest? Well, there won't be official meetings because, of course, um, any meetings that we have, uh, that I would have, uh, at the present moment, would be with the governor of that territory. Um, it is quite possible that um, some of my ministers uh, might be meeting Mr. Calendar to discuss various matters. But of course, you, you do appreciate that um, there is also Mr. Nkumbula, who has an equal st uh, uh, status in the Northern Rhodesian government with Mr. Calendar. And as a rule, one sees one and then one sees the other. But um, any official meetings of the sort, I think, that you suggest would in fact be held uh, between government and government rather than with uh, just one single individual like that. And you recently stated your intention of informing senior heads of states of the dominions of the true picture in southern Rhodesia. Have you made any progress in this respect? Well, yes, we have. Um, we drew up uh, a document, a factual document, which we, which we sent to all the governments of the Commonwealth uh, countries, all of them. And uh, I also sent personal letters with, uh, with them all and uh, explanatory notes to the governments of Australia and of New Zealand, uh, actually to the Prime Ministers. Have you had any reaction? And yes, I have. I've had a reply from all three Prime Ministers. Uh, we also issued invitations that they should send ministers here. But of course, Australia has to be awfully careful in sending anyone away, as they only have a majority of one, Mr. Menz, uh, Sir Robert Menzies' government. So they can't send one at this moment. Now, do you feel, sir, that there's any significance in the dispute over the leadership of the Southern Rhodesian African Nationalist Parties? And in the event of a new leader coming to the fore, would you be prepared to deal with him on matters affecting the welfare of Southern Rhodesia? Well, I'll deal with the last part of what, you're saying, of what you've asked me first. Uh, I will deal with anybody in this country. They're all Rhodesians as far as I'm concerned, and particularly if they've got anything to contribute in the political or any other sense. So I think that deals with that. Uh, you, you then ask me, is there any particular significance in the dispute that is That's going right. on? Yes, there is. I think it simply emphasizes the personal nature of, African, of politics in Africa, and of African politics for that matter, and African politicians because it does appear to me that this is a struggle for individual authority and power. And uh, what the outcome of it will be, I don't know. All I can say is that they're not serving their country in any beneficial way whatsoever by continuing this internal strife of theirs. Thank you very much indeed. La France était